Hey guys, it's your girl Amy here today, <laughs> and um, so Marcus forced me to uh, watch Amnesia with him, and um, so I don't know what to expect. I know literally nothing about this game, um, and I've I've been told it was scary, and um, you know I'm I'm kind of kind of scared. So uh, yeah, Mark, stop playing with my headphones. Let's go. Okay, all right, cool, let's go. What is that? I don't even know what that is. Looks like a shield. Uh, oh, that's scary. Um, let's not use that or ever see that again, okay? Sounds good, okay. Don't forget. That's not terrifying. Hi, Daniel. You good, bro? You dying or something? Oh, I didn't know that. It's not like you told me that two seconds ago, but I'm kind of concerned for your well-being, dude. I mean, okay. <laughs> I don't like those footsteps or whatever they were. Okay, but that sounds terrifying. This is, mm. No, thank you. Ew, that looks like blood. Okay. Wow, okay. I'm more than confused right now. Um. This place looks like a loving home. I would want to live here for sure. It's a castle. Looks like a dungeon. Tinder box. Should we speak a little louder? Cause who doesn't want a Tinder box? That good? That loud enough for you? Cool. Ew. Hey, Mark, it's mannequin. Night thingies for you. Man, that would be my dream. Oh, that's a floating head. Oh. What'd that night ever do to you? Jeez. Oh, uh, that looks like a, a ghost or something. Oh, ew. Okay. That thing looks ugly. But, like, it's dirty. And, ugh. This game's in the 1800s. Okay. I hate the sound of broken glass. That does not sound so good to me. Um... Why do you have a broom in the closet? Like, this place is dirty enough as it is. I mean, this thing hasn't been cleaned in years. Why would you have a dirty broom in a closet? Honestly, confusion, that's me. Okay, this is really tripping me out with the side angles. Okay, uh, stop, stop. <laughs> I am so confused right now. Am I supposed to know what's going on? Okay, cool. Ew, ew. I don't like that sound. <laughs> ew. What the heck? What are you doing? <laughs> Why are you peeking? Is there something in here? Uh, I don't like it. Can we get out of here, please? <laughs> I don't like it in here. Everything's a mess. It, this is like the scene in a horror movie where that dumb person is just, you know, investigating the rooms and they're just waiting to be killed. Because honestly... Okay, again with the broom. Are we like a witch or something? I don't... Okay. You know... Ah! Stop! Stop! That's tripping me out. Okay. Oh, this room's a little bit more welcoming. Oh, never mind. It's not welcoming at all. I take it back. What? Okay, why are we hiding in a closet? Are these like magical closets? Is this like the lion, the witch, and the wardrobe where it teleports you to a different world? Because <laughs> I'm confused. Ew. It's, uh, old archives? I don't know what that means. Okay, I don't know what, if that's a good thing or not. This thing is creepy. This game isn't scary, it's just terrifyingly, like... I don't know. I don't know. Terrifyingly 
awful. <laughs> I don't know. Ew, this place is even worse. It's so uh, These places are haunted. Yep, definitely haunted. Ew. This looks like where Gollum lives in like Lord of the Rings. Are those fish? Cockroaches. Ew! Get out of there! Get out of there! No one likes cockroaches! Go away! <laughs> okay, cool. What's the paper? What's the papers doing that? What's that? Why is that a book? What is this? I don't like it. 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 Ew. Oh, it's a lantern. I didn't know what it was. Okay. Um boxes light up torches. Okay, but why do we have so many tinder boxes? Are we gonna be in dark places? Oh. But like why do we, why do we have to have so many tinder boxes? Because honestly, if we're gonna be in dark places, this is not gonna be good. It's an earthquake. What? Don't look at me like that. It's creepy. Okay, stop. If you hide in the closet again, I might just have to leave. Am I supposed to be Is this the game with the grunt or whatever it's called? Or is that a different game? I'm so confused. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. What? There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. So you have faith in yourself? God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner center. Find Alexander and kill him. Nah, I'm good. His body is old and weak. Yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. Let's not do that. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's yeah. a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Okay, I have one tiny question. Why didn't anybody tell me there was a shadow following us? No, I didn't. Okay, well, that's terrifying. Let's get him to leave. How do we get him to leave? I don't like it. I don't. I don't like it. Well. I'll tell you one thing, it's red. Okay, shadows are supposed to be black. Why would a shadow be red? I'm so confuzzled. This game makes zero sense. Okay, okay, cool. This is our new safe haven for me. Ew! This, is safe this haven thing does me. not look pretty. Is it inside the castle? In the of speaking, come with the land. You bring the refinery, do not. And don't believe I have. Is it connected to the. What did you call it? Is the the inner center. The most precious chamber down the See, this is where we're gonna die. Ew! In fact, it lies beneath the very stone. Let's not go in there, okay? I don't like it. What was that on the wall? Like, blood? That's the shadow? That's what he leaves behind. I was thinking it was like a person shadow, not a bunch of glue. Or goo, or whatever you call it. Oh, let's end. not. But the red stuff is what it is. It's red. It's red let's it goes, not it look at the shadow, okay? Sounds cool. Ew, what is that? Uh -huh. Let's get out of here. <sighs> Tabularium? This is the scariest part? But then why are we going down here? Let's you not. No, we don't. We don't have to finish this game. We can just leave Daniel to die. 
It's fine. <laughs> what was that? You were like, for the fans, and then pointed up in the air. I'm so confused. Ew. Uh, Libri Rary? Rare books. Oh, okay. Good thing there's translation. What even language is that? I'm Nigeria? Nigeria? Algeria. Oh, Algeria. That's not random at all. I didn't get a word of that. Okay, get these darn cockroaches out of here. The way they crawl on the ground, I don't like it. I've never been a fan of bugs. I've gotten better, but I hate cockroaches. Just get them away. Get them away. Ew, okay, why uh, Why does this all look all funky? You're giving me a headache. Do we not have either, apparently? Okay, well, why do you search through all these drawers and find a tinderbox? Like, who just leaves tinderboxes lying around? always a good idea to walk in a creepy mansion slash castle and you know just search the rooms and look at all these okay cool and look at all these you know weird diaries and notes to self that you left but you apparently don't know like that you left it so it's not creepy at all I think this is a great idea we should stay in here forever because you know, why not? What's up with this dude? took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we are covered. I talked his burn faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I busted my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes with broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting part emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. Oh. I was trapped. That sounds lovely. I hate how these doors open so slow. It's honestly terrifying. What is that? Oh my gosh! That scared me. I was not expecting that. Old tombs? Oh, tomes. I was gonna say. Uh, 
<sighs> okay, okay, okay. I, 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 why is there like a heartbeat? Is that ours? Are we going crazy or something? Like, are we not okay? A slight headache, all is good. Okay, you sure? Because it doesn't seem like all is good. I mean, look where we are. I'm sorry, I keep coming back to the castle, but this place is terrifying. No. I've never seen a floating chair before. Well, I know, but like, why? <laughs> I'll throw it at him. Okay, um. Why are you opening up all these drawers? I'm come puzzled. It's always a great sign when there's a piano. Okay. There's always a great sign where there's just a vacant piano and boarded up windows and broken ceiling tiles on the ground. Stop. Okay, what was that? Why are there boulders in here? Why is... Okay, I don't think those wood planks are doing anything. What? What? Ew, what is that? Maps. What? They're maps? maps. Those are like, okay. But why do they have so many maps? We're in a castle. I know, you told me we're in a castle. Fragile but not breakable by hand. Well? Okay, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Mark, if you love me at all. Mark, I am your younger sister. Get me out of here before I die. <laughs> this thing is terrifying. Okay, okay, cool. Uh, what's up with all these boarded up windows? Honestly. Okay. Oh, crap. Anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk that we will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Aren't you dumb? Here and there. Let's get the servants working on it. My gosh. Okay. Um. Oh, okay, I don't like that part. Are we somewhere else now? No oh, okay. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. What? I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers, began to spark, brightening and spirit me away. Unlocking alien memories of the spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next Ugh, thing I can nice geometry. is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling to safety. Grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of their most human Well, yay, we've been saved! <laughs> so, we found the artifact where we had the 
found it broken in its hands. Oh. That's, gonna, that's the key to all this. Okay. I hate all these whispering you have to noises. Be when you activate the first one, you hear that. Oh, it's the classic. You'll have to start over. Uh, Isn't all this a bit excessive? The classic. You can oh. never be too careful. Then. Okay, guys. cool. Uh, I'll never get it. That's a good idea. I never know I'm in here either. Okay. Here we go. Well, let's Monsters. turn the lights on. There's local folklore. Another region rich with lore is Alstad, deep within the East Perugian woods. For centuries, there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, uh, Castle Burning Brennenberg. I figured. The quiet forest-clad mountains dressed with scattered lakes is as picturesque, I don't know, as can be. Albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Great! Ask any local and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. Awesome! All of them have their own twists on the tables, but there are some motif motifs that keep reappearing. Great. Motifs pick one. The Gatherers. This story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that the soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the doomed. cold dark and were forever doomed to roam the grounds. Their body, uh, wrought by their tainted souls, have left them disfigured and empty of essence great awesome i love this story I we're gonna them. <laughs> many have cited them over the years and described them as a horrid revenants they move silently through the woods shying away from any beholder they are called gatherers as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures oh well, that sounds awesome it is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp Burglip sacks dragged behind them, which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? I prefer not to find out. A visit undone. Henrik Cornelius Agrippa. He's important. The well-known Edrunite. I don't know any of these words. Visited all statted at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight a fortnight <laughs> as he looked for remnants of kingdoms past during his stay all the prominent members of society paid notice and he is mentioned in many records of the time one day he went to investigate a burrow in the northwest glades only to never be seen again oh that sounds amazing henrich is known to have passed away in grenoble some 10 years later he dismissed the notion of ever visiting alstead and which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods and what happened to him? Great. The Immortal Baron. The Baron of Bredenburg lives a reclusive... Don't do that! Life with his family at the castle nearby Halstead. And like most of those of noble birth move your head <laughs> rumors are narrated <laughs> alongside with the title researching the history reveals little before the castle was consumed stop <laughs> by fire in the late 16th century it was rebuilt by alexander a nobleman from the rhinelands claiming the role as protector of the prussian state i think i remember hearing the name alexander Alexander helped the region of flourish and remain popular throughout the presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage. Therefore, b the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago, lived through the time of occupation, and joined the co coveted 
Order of the Black Eagle along with the great leaders of his, of this country. So he's years old. Wow. No wonder he said he was old and fragile. <laughs> I don't know about you, but those sounded really uplifting to me. <laughs> what do you mean to remember it's about the gatherers? There, really Almost reminds me of the Lost from the Evil Within. Like the description of it. <laughs> Moving bookcase, always great. Stop laughing like that! You sound like freaking Markiplier! Um, you know, we just got a few dislikes. What? We just got a few dislikes now. It's okay. Nothing against Markiplier. I'm just saying. Well, and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the force and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail of Brennan Burke. I need to lock Willem and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first... They can rot for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would be a sense solve. It would be a sense solve both of my problems. Well, that was very nice. Stop hiding. Someone, did I hear that? Someone just kicked the door open. Okay, but why are you hiding in a closet? It's not like people can open closets. <laughs> nope. My barricade. Wow. That sucked. Who's in here? Don't tell me it's Alexander or whoever it is. Cause he doesn't sound like a guy I want to be. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is that? I'm sorry. I'm like terrified. Is this like the grunt or something? Or those ugly people? The gatherers? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Get her away. Get her away. Get her away. What? hallucination then but that thing's ugly I'm sorry <laughs> I was not expecting it to just show up behind us don't go in there you're like that dumb person from a horror movie okay well you can break down one of those windows over there uh. It sounds like the <laughs> zombies from Minecraft, the bleh, or whatever it is. Saw it. I saw what? Someone's Wasn't that like the grunt or something? Or? I know I've seen him before. Together. He's a gatherer? But isn't he called the grunt? Ew. Oh no, 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 it's the shadow guy. Get it out. Ugh. Oh. This dude's not okay. Was it? Oh, that yeah, you're kind of dying there, dude. Wine cellar key. Why do we have that key? Can we just not go in here? Why are we even here in the first place? Honestly, I'm confused about everything. Literally, everything in this game confuses me. We're trying to get through. This. No! Uh -huh. No, we're gonna burn it. We're gonna burn it. Uh, we're gonna burn it, so we're trying to get uh, acid now. We're gonna find acid in the wine cellar, then we bring the chemicals uh, to the laboratory, make it into proper acid. There's a freaking laboratory? Laboratory. Laboratorium. Uh. Not tall enough to do that, sorry, Mark. <laughs> How long is this game? Oh, okay. We can break it down to a few episodes then. Just tell me when you're ready to. Into one straight line stream. Straight, Mar, that's gonna take forever. I don't want to be here for four hours. I don't like them. Right. They sound the obnoxious. Chemicals. Found the four chemicals. First one down. Cup right. Oh, is it the Moose Man? I think I've heard something about him before. The mooing. 
I think. Moo. Hey, Anna, this one's for you with those cows, though. Okay, I'll just stop talking. Boy, oh. there's nothing there. Oh. That was uh, I don't like the sound. Oh, that's a lovely picture. Oh, is it in the drink? <gasps> oh. Watch your profanity. <laughs> well, I mean, they're about to die, so I don't blame them too much. My name is Willem, House of Gretchen. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle of Brandenburg, as most of the aristocracy. I was curious about what the supposed knight of the order could want from me, and I accepted the invitation. The baron was friendly and offered me a pro proposition. proposition. That's what I was going to say. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid. Uh, and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors I've been rewarded during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon... Oh! Yeah, he is. yeah, upon his slightest whim and to do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, <clears throat> I've brought men, women, and children to Brennenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even hun a hundred. None of them who, whom were ever, were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and the men down to the wine cellar to <laughs> Oh, that sounded painful. Down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment of our sins. The Baron had locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into a diabol in his diabolical ways. My men are screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer. That's lovely. I think Daniel's, like, not doing so well right now. Oh, there's footsteps now? Great. Why is there purple now? It was pink before. Nasty. Nasty. Ruben. Oh, okay. No. Ruben! <laughs> Shameless plug to Minecraft story mode. <laughs> oh, red. Oh, that's not good. We're gonna die. Cause this is what it seems like. This is gonna be the end of us. Bye, world, and all that inhabit it. Number three. Okay, why do we even care at this point? We're like about to freaking you'll die. You'll see why okay. Okay. I don't like it. You'll see why Daniel cares. Ah, that noise. Oh. Is there ever just a nice place? A few cuts and bruises. That's great. I've got scars and bumps and bruises, plus something here that oozes. And let's not even mention my complexion. Great. Okay, why would you do that, dummy? But why do you have to move that? Oh, there's the door there, of course. I didn't even notice that. I feel really dumb now.
Uh, well, let's not go I'll out there then. These monsters can impersonate voices, anyway. Oh, it's like the Wendigo. Yeah. Ha! <laughs> as much. They only use it against you once. One time that you can actually get caught from it. Okay, cool. You'll remember that scene if you play. You'll never forget that moment when you realize what it really is. Mm. More sanity. It's a reward for completing it. Yes, we have more sanity. That's always good when you have some sanity, because it allows you to love a little bit. That looks like a weird relic or something. Aw, well, let's not go up there then. Okay, sounds great. Mm, these sounds. I hate these sounds. The sounds make this ten times more terrifying than it actually is, honestly. Uh, okay, wh what are we doing? What are we doing? For a second, I thought something like was dragging us. And I was like, wait, what's happening? But no. Oh my gosh, we don't need a freaking tinderbox at a time like this. Are you freaking kidding me right now? <laughs> Let's not go up there. Sound good? Cool. Is this the wine cellar, right? Okay. This is a big wine cellar. Yeah, but it's terrifying. They couldn't add some wallpaper. There's green now? There's purple, pink, and green? Oh, great. Mark, don't be dumb. What's that red puddle? Blood? No, it's wine. Oh. It's, it's a wine cellar. Sorry, I'm paranoid right now. Those footsteps are coming closer. I don't like it. I don't like it. Laudanum. Laudanum. Yeah, get it away. Oh, I think I've seen that dude before. Look at him. What? So oh, well, don't look at him. Good luck. Come here. Who's that? Come here. That dude was like lumbering, like. Hey, you, come over here. Mark, you're dumb. Come over there and then we'll get you're like that dumb person in a horror movie who goes outside to check if there's anything up. Well. Let's get out of here. The laboratory is safe. I the entrance hall. That's that big area we've been to. I know. I wonder who's going to pass it through now. Sat down by the computer. Mmm. Mm, I don't like. Oh, okay. Get it away. Get it away. Get it away. <laughs> uh, I don't like it. I really don't like it. That looks like disgusting food. Who would eat that? It was at that moment when he realized it was food and not like a dead corpse or something. <laughs> Ew. 
a water monster or something? <gasps> Wait, this is from your... Oh, I get it now. It's from your game you made in like 8th grade. With the water monster dude. I don't like that voice. I know, I don't like it. It reminds me of something, and I don't know what. Terrifying. This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae. The former compounds lack the potency I need, but I sense I'm close. Calamine and orphiment are a given, and cuprite binds them well. This time I will attempt aqua region instead of aqua fortis, and hope it will produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid and yeah, it's highly acid and proves impractical to put to any use except for a detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with the greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I am losing hope that I will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Picked up chemistry pot. Oh, I didn't even notice. I'm not that observant, if you can tell. You just know what you already know. Blah, 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 blah. Same about the wine cellar. Came here first. Oh, okay, cool. This wine cellar is huge, though. This is a laboratory room. This is like We're an alcohol extreme. We're in the laboratory right now. <laughs> Wait, what? We went to the laboratory. Oh, that's right. Because we passed the creepy hallway thingy. Just kidding. Something just happened out there. Something's coming down the stairs. Uh, I do too. I'm not the one playing. You better hurry. Yay. Why is it green? That makes it ten times more acid. terrifying. But like green acid? Is acid green? Yeah. No, it's not. Acid's not green. Oh well. Too bad. So sad. Uh -oh. oh well this Oh uh, What? That's why I did that. Mm -hmm. Well obviously, but like who is talking? That was, to ourselves. That was loud. Destroy that red Um I hate this place. I'm out of there. I hate this place. It's disgusting. Ew. Get it away. Oh my gosh. Get her up here. Say goodbye to us. You know what? I want to just leave. You want to just leave? Yeah, let's just go. Bye, everyone. See you later. We'll just never deal with this again. Cool. Yep. I. Aw, you. You seriously had to do that, didn't you? You just had to do it. I wanted to go, but no. Try to leave the thing. Ugh. I hate that stuff. It's disgusting. It's tough and plain. It can't be torn by hands or tools. I said. Pew. Goodbye. Ew. That does not look healthy. Refinery. Refinery. Cloth smelled of desert and damp yeah, dust. Really Musk. Bum, bum. Oh, that's bright compared to what this has been. It sure is dark in here. Well. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. Stop. What's the reason? The darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. What? Not straying, stay with the way. Okay, is Alexander Drew just confusing me? Great. Go home. Ew! 
disgusting though. Good, good hearing bad eyesight. I was gonna say, is this thing everywhere? Is it here? If it's here, let's not be here. I hate that noise. Hey, it's the day after my birthday. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to Earth. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I. He's herb. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. And tried to assemble it with what I could do. The pieces wouldn't fit together as if they weren't in the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? wine here what the but like I know it's the wine cellar but still enough with the tinder boxes why is there a rope hanging from the ceiling right underneath us there's a rope why is there a rope right there we kill ourselves uh, well, it cer certainly seems like someone would do it here. Feel the need to continue this journey, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. Just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the all back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are definitely strange. They seem to careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified. I rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care, and we discussed how rocks change form. Mm. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself. Like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. This class have to do with anything. But I can't escape the feeling that these shards are otherworldly properties. Uh not the sight thingy again. I hate that thing. Wait, what's his mental state at? Great. You don't die again. I know, but still. Oh my gosh, stuff is everywhere. Okay. Great. Let's n mm, go. Oh my. What? Okay, but. I don't even know anymore. Why is this so uh, oh that's a huge barrel. No. We do? No We're not going in there. There's probably a freaking monster or something. Okay. Oh mm. I hate it. I hate it. Uh, uh -huh. We're gonna die. <laughs> We're gonna die here. <laughs> End the video after this whole scene. Uh, that's actually like the next. Okay. Memorable scenes in the game. 
Great. Oh, I hated that noise. That sounds so helpless. Ah. There's gonna be a monster in here, isn't it? Yep. Music. Oh, I know. I, I don't even see anything. I don't even see anything. I just see a bunch of splashing. Oh yeah, my gosh, no one needs that, Mark. Yeah, just, get get that. That. just get out of here. Just get out of here. Okay, I did not like that sound. Okay, that sounded terrifying. I hate this music. Get it away. What? Uh, now it's hiding. It's hiding from us. Take this. Yeah, throw a book at it. Because you know what? A book is going to help, right? Because that is a smart idea. Mark, that's the Bible. Oh. Don't throw the Bible! <laughs> what? You are a good Christian kid. You don't throw the Bible at okay, Water that's, Monsters. That's a documentary. Take this. That's fine. <laughs> throw a bone at it. Don't throw the Bible I at Water Monsters. The Bible. <laughs> Biblia. I didn't know. Biblia. It's Bible in Amnesia Land. Yeah, in here. The Lord knows we need the Bible in this land. It's not right. That's nasty. Watch. You get distracted. Been distracted? Distraction. Why is there a gate in here anyways? It doesn't keep anything keep out. Thing but just go, just go. Don't even survey. Just go. Yeah, just don't. I gotta get another distraction out there. No. Ah! <gasps> what does this thing do if it gets ya? Bites you. Pulls you under. It pulls you under? A week delay. Well, wouldn't that suck? Ah, uh, go run, run faster than you ever run. It can't go through doors. What? Then how come there was a gate there before and it stayed in? Go! What are you doing? Go! Oh my gosh, you were just standing there, dummy. Are we ending it here? Uh, yeah, this, this oh, okay. This is the last area. Next okay, one. cool. So this is the last scene, and then I'll be on to video two, because we don't want to make it too long, obviously. You see the shadow now? I thought you said you see it at the end. <sighs> what? No, but that's not our problem. He's back. The water monster? Yep. Oh, go away! He's breaking them down. Shadow's go away, you water too. monster. D well, is we're... Is game me? We're pretty much out of luck now. I mean... <laughs> Some of that music, Amy. I hate this music. This literally sucks. Go 
go away. Ah, oh, oh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Go away. 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 It's the music. Go away. Go. Why is that thing moving? <laughs> go away. Mark, it's coming for you. You dummy. Is that, is that music? Oh. Hey, Paul. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just standing there and it's coming straight for you. Ha, oh, you're so dumb. Okay. So we're ending it here, everybody. And uh so we'll see you guys in the next video and like this video if you enjoy my commentary and like it if you just like amnesia because I know I can be annoying sometimes. So, okay people, we'll see you next video.